we're having dinner at Kona Cafe at Disney World's Polynesian Village Resort. Let's eat. doing a whole series in the Polynesian Village Resort rather than I think I learned my mistake when we did Coronado Springs or Grand Esquino, Sam. You jammed everything into one yeah. video. And it was over an hour so I'm breaking down all the different food options into different videos. We actually had breakfast at Kona which we love and we figured I mean, the food looks great why not have dinner here too. Yeah and know? we couldn't get into Trader Sam's yet so that, we're like yeah. we can that was the real factor. That, that may have added to it. Uh, Trader Sam's currently has a two and a half hour wait and they're not accepting any more walk-ins so we have to wait till 6 30 to be added to the walk-in list. Probably won't be there, be there till eight. That We will try to make that a separate video if we can get in. However, we are very excited to eat at Kona Cafe, which is located on the second floor of the Polynesian Village Resort, right where you can find the monorail line and Ohana. A lot of great things, right, Sam? Yeah. see on the menu? Chicken and pot stickers. Airline chicken, I wonder what airline sushi. chicken is. Yes. I that, mean, I the I breakfast was amazing. So, I mean, if it's just Tom as good as Paul. breakfast. Yeah, I'm really excited to try out the dinner all these sort of different options. Again, a very beautiful scenic resort. Uh, Maui we welcoming you in right as you walk in, so. And we didn't need a reservation. Yes. We joined the walk up. And it was 15 minutes at about five o'clock. So very easy to get a walk in here. And the food is very good for breakfast. So let's see how it is for dinner. As usual, we'll rate everything one to 10. If you enjoy the content, please like, subscribe. Join us for our dinner here, Polynesian Village Kona Cafe. So they started us off with some Hawaiian bread. I'm wondering if these are King's Hawaiian rolls. <laughs> I mean, I wouldn't complain. I mean, everyone loves the King's Hawaiian rolls, right? They're, they're definitely hot. I don't think they're made fresh in the house, but they're warmed up. They also obviously gave us some butter. We got, um, actually also got an appetizer of some of their sushi, because they are, I think, known for their sushi here. Had a spicy tuna roll. Sam, you actually got their special. What did you get? I got the uh, chicken stir fry. Yeah, it sounded really good. And I got the corn braised beef short rib. I got the thing with their name in it. And we had the pot stickers for an appetizer as well. I love pot stickers. Yeah, it's a warmed up pink Hawaiian roll. I ain't complaining. It's good. Put pink Hawaiian roll. I'll give it like a six for the pink Hawaiian roll. I like it. All right, so the pot stickers and the sushi just came at the same when time. When they crispy pot stickers, they're not eating like it's like a crust. Yeah, it looks like they fry them in a pan, and the sauce is drizzled around the edge, so you just kind of dip it in that sauce on the edge. So those look like really good pot stickers, and I've heard positive things about the pot stickers here. That's the best pot sticker I've ever had. Really? Those are some high marks, and is a big fan of pot stickers. One of the ten. Now this is the spicy tuna roll. It doesn't look like a standard, standard spicy tuna roll because it doesn't have that uh, like orange type of tint to it. I'm just going to pour some uh, right on top of it. I feel like Kona Cafe is like a hidden gem. I feel like everyone goes to Ohana, but I feel like this place is a little underrated. <laughs> I'm gonna go get a seven. Really good. Yeah. I'm gonna dip it in this sauce, Sam. I need to know what you think. It's like the top crust is so good. Mm. That's a good box, okay? You should eat. <laughs> We're gonna eat at Ohana too for dinner, and I want to debate with him what you think is is better because I honestly, I'm really giving the food right now. Alright, dinner is here, Sam. That one is good. It looks very good. So this is the stir fry with chicken. Uh, noodles, I think, are the thing they're known here for here at the Polynesian. Everyone loves the Polynesian. I like the noodles at uh, Captain Cook's actually a lot. Nice, just cutting in that chicken now. Mm -hmm. It came off pretty clean. I'm trying to get... A little bit of everything. This isn't going to work. <laughs> Gotta slurp. 
sauce is so good. The chicken is really juicy. One out of ten. It looks so good. There's so much here. I feel like this could feed like three people. Oh my god. <laughs> well, I can have a few bites if you want. I'm gonna give this an eight. It's good. Okay, so this is the corn braised beef shortbread. So a bit short it should be tender. It's the same too is tender. It's got a coffee, it's got a little coffee in its hand, so you actually might like this. Potatoes, broccolini. Mm. Not the best meat. It just tastes dry. I'll try it go on. It's too dry. It's a five. Oh, it's dry. Ooh, mm. fancy here then. That really good, but mm. this is dry. You could have some of my noodles. I have noodles to spare. All right, so that does it for our Kona Cafe dinner. Uh, when we started out, I was almost anticipating for them to beat Ohana, but I don't think they were quite there. Although I like the noodles. They are. I feel like they are, though. Ohana noodles. Yeah, they tasted just like the Ohana noodles. And you can get bread pudding there, so if you yes. can get an Ohana reservation, yeah. you're in luck. Just we didn't go for cafe. dessert only because we uh, didn't want to get too full, and uh, we're probably going to have dessert tonight. And you can get, like you said, some Ohana dessert there, too, which we'll have in another video. Definitely going to have that bread pudding when we do our Ohana video, which we haven't eaten. We haven't had bread pudding yet, but we haven't had this trip yet. I'm very excited for it. Uh, I don't think my short rib deserves the Kona name. Oh! <laughs> it was good. It was I salty and dry. I, I tried it. It was very good. Mine was perfect. You went with a nine, right? I think eight. Eight. I would agree with the eight. I think eight it's funny though sense. because when he said chicken stir fry, I was just expecting it to be like vegetables. Yeah, or rice. I wasn't yeah. expecting the noodles. I was trying to eat light and then I just ate a ton of noodles. I still think yeah, it was a great option. It's okay. Great choice. <laughs> uh, also, the pot stickers, so good and the sushi were so good. So, definitely did well. Didn't even expect to eat here. Ate here because we're getting at the Trader Sands. Very easily got in, got in within 10 minutes. Awesome, awesome option to have. And one of them, probably, you know, very uh, high up there meal, meal here at Disney World. If you enjoyed the content, please like, subscribe. Liking will really help our channel grow. It pushes this video out there into the stratosphere of the YouTube algorithm. Helps other people find the video. Subscribing also helps our channel grow. Hit the bell notifications. So that way you're notified every time the videos come out, which is Wednesday. Every Monday and Thursday at 12 p.m. Thanks so much for watching. Don't count the days. We'll make the days count. See you next time. That's all, folks. What I really want to come back is this Spirit of Aloha dinner show. In the I... tour, I found actually where they did the show, Sam. You weren't there with me. They did the on I was not. I'm like about to go in a little coma. <laughs> to be honest. Yeah, carbs. I'm very tired. Yes. Well, we've had a we've had a very tiring day. It's a good time though, and I'm, uh, it's very nice that we get to stay here. <laughs>